Okay, everybody, greetings and welcome to Let's Play Jurassic Park The Game! When last we left off... Nope. Nope. Yep, here we are. Episode 4, The Survivors. Looks like this was gonna be the last episode. Uh... Here we should finally see the, uh, the big thing that Telltale was telling us about, the, uh, the underwater research lab, where we should see all the aquatic creatures. This is what Telltale was really big and proud of. So, let's have a look-see at the, uh, journal before we get started here, because I keep forgetting about that. Okay. Trodon, Wandering Tooth, our mystery egg, egg hatched today, confirming our suspicions. They're Trododon... Uh, Trododon... Somethings. I'm thrilled to have achieved the result of my own lab, but Dr. Hammond is concerned that we've cloned a dinosaur that might not be fit that might not fit into his vision for the park. He wants a full evaluation before we add them to the list. Okay, got uh, geothermal power. Oh, fucking hell. The park's main power source is a geothermal plant driven by the latest Oh, the latent volcanic activity, sorry. Try, uh, re so rampant in this area. For some reason, Ray Allen and Dr. Hammond are... Re it's hard to make out the words because the handwriting's so bad and my TV is a true HD right now. Uh, are recent about sharing the procedure for shutting... Are reluctant. It has to be reluctant. Are reluctant about sharing the procedure to restarting the power. Although they claim secrecy is for security, Relying on a chosen few to present, to be present is blah blah blah. I feel less secure. I think I managed to figure it out on my own, just in case. The tunnel network. Once I got caught in the torrential downpour on the way back to the lab from the per parasaur pen, I was hopped. Blah, I cannot fucking read. Okay. If you guys want to read this, you can. If you can, otherwise, I'm just gonna browse through these. Oh, Velociraptors. The S Swift Caesar. Velociraptors are different significantly from their fossil record. They perhaps three times as large as they should be. They're definitely the Velociraptors, but based on size alone, I appear to have more in common with, all, with Utah Raptors, which they didn't discover until after the damn movie. Given up. Politically speaking, if he doesn't, nobody will. More stuff here I don't really care about. Oh, these are the fuck. these are the what's it's. Uh, I would have loved to have seen Dr. Something's face when we first discovered how the bones of a herosaurus and now of the oldest dinosaur species discovered reborn walking on our fa- walking on, on our faculties. Ooh. Uh... When we were engineering the Herbosaurus, I didn't mean... I didn't know they were meant to be safe. Alternative to the Velociraptor exhibit, though. Not nearly as smart as raptors, and they're... As their chase instinct makes them almost as dangerous. Uh, Compies, pretty jaws. I have to admit that the dinosaurs we've managed to clone so far, Compi holds a special place in my heart. I imagine it's because they remind me of chickens we used to have on the farm growing up. Law. Tyrannosaurus Rex, Tyrant Lizard King, Triceratops, and now we're just getting into all the old stuff. Okay. Oh, pfft. Well, that makes it easier to read. Just fucking told me that I could just zoom in and actually see the damn words talking during. I need to fight through the fucking screen. Our mystery eggs hash today can rise their Trotodon. I'm thrilled to have achieved the results on my own, on my own lab, but Dr. Hammond is concerned that we've got okay. Well that was needless. Alright. Let's get on with the show. Begin the episode! Yes. Alright, when last we left off, I believe Billy was about to kill Dr. Uh Bitch. So let's hopefully continue on that line of ideas. Alright! God, these loading screens take forever in this game! 
Even the pause menu. Seriously, Telltale, could you not have done something about the load screens? I will admit, though, that I am enjoying myself far more than I thought I would in this game. Uh, but I'm not about to give out judgment just yet. I suppose this all is going to boil down to who lives and who dies. Praying a lot of people die. Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do something! Shut up! Shut up! Tell us, Doctor, what's out there? What did this to him? Tro... They're called Trodon Pectinodon. They were meant to be euthanized, but... What? You let them out? No, no! I kept them in quarantine for study. They... Huh? I thought they may have been leaving the pen somehow, but I wasn't certain. We knew about those damn creatures all along. While we were out there, exposed, humping around like idiots looking for our pilot. Billy, humping wait. around? We were nearly killed by one of our own men. Probably bitten by one of those things just like decaf. Who knows where his catatonic body is now? Both our teams are dead. Oscar's dead. All because of your dinosaurs, all because of you. Okay, let's have a look see here. Oscar, those things. Help, Nima. I want to find out more about those things. Billy, listen, I get it. You're angry, but we need Laura alive. She's the only one here familiar with what we're dealing with. And what good does it do us if she keeps that intel to herself? Point taken. Anyway, this witch is a liar. She's lied to all of us. Put me in the direct line of danger to protect her agenda and her precious freak show. What else is she hiding? Please, if I knew sooner. Oh, I... Shut it. <laughs> we are not taking this bullshit. Uh, lied to all of us, put you in danger. Put you in danger? Is that what this is all about? She put you in danger? You're acting out of vendetta here? Oh, no. Don't turn this around on me. I'm doing this for Decaf and Vargas. But what is all this? She's a liar. How can you deny that? Hey, Nima, you got any ideas? Oh. She lied to all of us. How did she lie? Because she wouldn't tell us information without knowing the facts? She could have speculated. No. Speculating could have led us into even more danger. Bullshit! So what, I'm the enemy? I'm the bad guy here? I'm just trying to open your eyes. I'm trying to show you the truth and bring someone to account for it. Accountability. Injun is the enemy here. They spoiled the island. They made these Wrong monsters. option. You can't make her pay for all that Injun has done. Maybe. Put down the knife. We need to work together, all of us. All she has to say is it's my fault. It's my fault. Come on, Doc. Let me hear it. No, it wasn't. Say it! Do it! Because really, it was. It's... it's m my fault. There. It wasn't so difficult, was it? Your friends may have saved you here. At least I got the truth out of you. You want her alive? You've got it. Oh. Just mark my words. She will save just one of those animals before she lifts a finger to help you. Now, everyone make themselves useful. I got Yoder, to more like exploit. Yeah, that was a terrible. Shame on you, whoever wrote that achievement. Look, we can't stay here long. Let's just give Billy a minute and see if we can find anything useful, a way out even. Okay, we'll do a sweep of the room and check in when we're done. Agreed. It's what, 12 by 12? It should not take you long enough to actually have to check in. All right. Let's see, are the Raptor Mormons still out there? Maybe it's clear. Shh. All right, let's check over here. What's in the locker? It's a locked Lock. locker. Who'd have thought? B. I don't want to get stuck in a vent with a dinosaur. Besides, there's blood everywhere. Ow! Hot! Huh. Okay. Maybe a little lighting would help there, but... My bumper? A flare kit. Yeah! A flare kit. We might need to summon a T-Rex at some point. Okay.
Okay, so we have flares, we have hot. Let's check in with Jess. Just great. It's locked. Anyone happen to have a key? Check over here. What about this grate? It looks big enough for everyone. And it looks like it's heading in the right direction. Seriously, creepy awesome. Billy, we should cover decaf. I don't want Jess to see this. Yeah. Shh. <laughs> yeah, sure, whatever. Okay, he's got the talkie icon, so let's have a look see here. This totally isn't fair, eggs, Sorkin. I want to find out as much about these critters as possible. I don't understand. I thought the dinosaurs couldn't breed. They can't. They're all female. Then how do they lay eggs? Theropod shed eggs just like most other over um, egg-laying animals. Think about chickens. The whole egg market is made up of unfertilized eggs, right? Oh, yeah. So they still have to lay them? Oh, my. What is it? You bring up a good point about our dinosaurs ovulating. But these eggs are gathered in a clutch. This is brooding behavior. So? Chickens will brood a large enough clutch, but not our dinosaurs. I've found post-ovulatory eggs in the ranges. They're mal-shaped, usually destroyed or kicked into the bush. Oh, boy. I see. Wait, it, we can't jump to any conclusions. How could this even be possible? Frogs! Did a girl dino turn into a boy dino? With Dr. Wu's slapdash approach to gene sequencing, anything could go wrong. Oh, hey, guess what? We're fucked! They're finally figuring that out! Are you okay? Jess, hon, leave him alone. He may bite. Okay. This totally isn't fair. The vent, the lockers. Could I pick this lock? Not that I would know how. I don't want to add breaking an entry onto my dad's list of my criminal tendencies. Uh-huh. Okay, this totally isn't fair. So if this whole trip was, like, set up to scare me away from shoplifting, mission accomplished. Still, I don't think it's quite as effective as that one scene from Evolution. I liked that movie. I know most people thought it was stupid, but I thought it was a fun little flick. Also took place in my home state. Like Eight-Legged Freaks, another movie I like. Okay, back to the dinosaurs. These Trodon, what else can you tell me about them? Well, they're nocturnal. They're intelligent, like raptors. But they don't hunt like them. They envenomate with a single bite, then back I off. think you're making that Stop word up. Pay. Their teeth are serrated and retain saliva and the saliva is saturated with a toxin. Nema's bite. It was from a Trodon? Yes. Definitely. So wait a minute! You already knew that they were out when you heard that Nima was bitten! Bullshit! Uh, Trodon bit you? Nima, what can you remember about that animal that bit you? I didn't see it when it attacked. It went by so fast. It was dark. After a bit me, I became confused, like, like I'd been drugged. I remember there were many of them. They had glowing eyes. Glowing eyes? Yeah, like ojos del lobo. Mm. Uh, let's switch over to Nima real quick and see what she has to say before we start saying we need to go. What the hell? Let's try opening the door. Leave the door alone. We're not going back out that way. Why not? Because we aren't backtracking, and those damn creatures could still be out there. Point taken. Nima's an idiot. Stay close, Jess. We should go self-trapped like a rat. I hate being trapped on here like a rat. I have to wonder about what the point of some of these dialogue choices actually are. 